in the 2022 FIFA World Cup Final. And we're with you every step of the way. Live coverage here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Belgium versus Croatia. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The starting players for Belgium. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Toby Alderweireld plays with Jan Vertonghen at the back. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Yuri Tielemans in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Aidan Azar starts alongside Romelu Lukaku. And the starting 11 for Croatia. Mateo Kovacic starts alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. And so the match is underway. Minier. Here's Tielemans. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. But timely defending when it mattered. Ivan Perisic. of this 2022 World Cup final. One to save it. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. And Belgium get us moving again. A quick reply required after the disappointment of conceding. Can he take the chance? And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. Well, no card handed out. He gets away with a rebuke. Well, a lot of referees would have booked him there. But I'm with him on this one. No yellow card for me. Can they extend their lead? In it goes. A well-taken penalty. Well, here it is again, and just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? It should be! Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Chance to finish! Well, not great on the accuracy front. Goal kick here.
Van Aken. And now Perisic. And crossing towards the far post. And the keeper diving to thwart him. Delivering it. And a throw in it's going to be. Andre Kramaric. He's played it over the middle to Carrasco. Well, they couldn't keep it. Counter-attacking, very much an option. And now Perisic. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, the referee making it clear on a different day. It could have been a booking. Well, the free kick lacking just a little bit of guile. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. He's in behind. Oh, he's got himself in hot water. Well, no card, just a warning. And Stuart, you're furrowing your brow. Well, he's got away with that one. He hasn't even got a yellow card. That's a very strange decision, I would say. Well, I think he'll be a bit cross with himself based on that free kick. Not the execution he was looking for. Good effort here! Well, how close was that? Inches away. Well, those stats back up what we've been watching. It's been a really one-sided game, and it's far too easy for them to open up this defence. This could turn into a rout. Kramaric. Oh, he's through here. Oh, getting boot on ball, but that's disappointing. Well, there was lots of power in it, but he just couldn't control the shot. That's a very poor finish. Perisic, can he make it count? Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Kramaric. And well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. And not a great challenge. Free kick here. No yellow card. Instead, a firm warning from the official. Gobbled up by Courtois. A high degree of difficulty with that sort of attempt. Well, he's just mistimed it, hasn't he? Didn't catch it how he would have wanted, and well, that's the result. Anakin. Lukaku Carrasco in the middle well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done cut out beautifully by Alderweireld it's Carrasco making his way into a promising area what next? Could pull one back here. And up for grabs off the keeper. And second time around, he scores. But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see. But unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really.
So Belgium just one behind now, and you sense the momentum may actually be with them. And space for them here. Finish it! And the keeper more than equal to it. corner from Modric and the goalkeeper doing what he's paid to do behind for another corner can they cash in look at Modric with the corner routine really Making a bit of headway. Real chance. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So back underway at 3 1. Oh, what an opportunity! And a goal! They're running riot here, almost out of sight. Well, just look at the defending here. They just don't read the danger. It's a poor goal to concede. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Ivan Perisic. I just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Vanaken. Long way out. Well, the net was staring him in the face, but he couldn't put it away. Five minutes remaining, but you just feel this is over already. Azar. Well, three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Well, let's call it a meaty effort, but certainly not accurate enough. Ivan Perisic, might be a chance here. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Now sending it in. And the referee blows the whistle for full time. We have new World Cup winners, namely Croatia. Well, four years ago, they got to the final and were frustrated. This time, they've gone one better. And what a great performance from them. Croatia, world champions!
The beaten finalists in 2018 are the winners in 2022. And what a night it is, especially for their fans. They've followed their team here. The players have played brilliantly. The coach has done a great job as well. What a night for everybody involved with Croatia. And now they get the ball rolling.